Okay, it took me four minutes and 48 seconds to wash everything. I kind of, you know, slow down and do it as a meditation. I, I try to do a good job of it and not leave little specks of food and stuff like that around. But anyway, here's the, here's the tricks of the trade. So this is the, you can use pretty much anything to clean, to wash that guy. I mean, we use this, this OXO scrubber, which works pretty well. And there's also an OXO round thing, which I'm going to show you we use a lot. So this guy goes pretty quick. And then this other plastic one, there's nothing goofy about that. So that one goes pretty quick. This one here is easy to clean. It goes pretty quick. And that hole in the middle, it's amazing that this round thing right here just squeezes right through it and completely cleans it up, gets any grease off. So this round OXO thing you, is just, just a bomb for cleaning the stuff up. So that was how we cleaned that one. Uh, this guy's easy. You just kind of run it through water. That's the pusher. Um, this one here, this piece, is completely, uh, we've got two round, well, actually three round holes here. This inch one, even though this OXO scrubber looks so much bigger, it, it compresses down and you can shove it right through there and you can completely clean that entire tube with this one device. This is the device you need to, to clean that guy. Um, on the other end here, the big end, this fits in no problem, cleans up really good. And also this little hole in the bottom. Uh, this thing actually, if you can believe it, it squeezes down enough and you can squeeze this through there as well and completely clean that out. Without this tool, it would be a pain, but with that tool, cleaning this guy is like a piece of cake. Uh, this is the front piece. There's nothing funky about that. You can probably just squirt this thing out. It cleans up really good. There's no weird edges or anything. And uh, this one here, there's a trick to this one. This is a big piece of melamine. And uh, you can get to pretty much everything except for right in here, right in that little corner there where my thumb is, stuff gets jammed sometimes. So what I've done is I use one of these guys, and you can put this guy right in there. Anyway, I could, I'd show you if I had two hands. But anyway, you can get this guy right in there and, and completely clean that little corner. That's the only thing that's hard to get. And this tool right here is the tool that does the job. So that's the grinder. And the last piece, and the only one's a bit of a trick, is the actual juicing screen. And the screen itself, they come with this toothbrush here. And so I just scrub the screen while spraying it, and that gets it pretty good. And you, you can pretty much get the toothbrush straight in there. And then this little rubber grommet here is about a millimeter deep. And so you can use the, uh, the end of this guy, which is kind of a poker, or you can use the tip of this OXO little device here, and you can use that rubber tip and just completely clean out the rim there. And you can also slide it in here and clean out the rim. My finger's on it. You can clean out the inside of the rim. So you can get this guy completely clean with those two devices. That's it. There's all the parts completely clean. It takes about five minutes, but it's a nice meditation uh, and worth doing. Okay, bye.